love oh, nini and saga just enjoying their relationship friendship everything <laughs> but guys saga i'm really happy for this guy Sha. you see him singing with nini siblings all happy and free wow guys they seem to really really like saga well who wouldn't like saga such a bubbly happy so who wouldn't like him next one Sha. i mean family that sings together stay together right new jam featuring the okusa guys on the side <laughs> so adorable Sanini peaceful sheep, oh, hmm. with peaceful fan base, or like some parasites that just want to finish their faith with toxicity and unending negativity. Now, wah. And what was that that Nini did just now? What was that that Nini did just now? Shaking bum bum or twerking, I'm waiting at the color. <laughs> oh, Nini <the> big bear. <laughs> Beautiful people, really happy for them once again. May no evil eyes, most especially in the form of evil fans. Evil fans, not see you guys oh, in Jesus' name. Amen. Now, talking about evil fans, hey, God, I am tired on this guy's behalf. I mean, Emmanuel and the Kuros. I know other housemates are getting the same energy, but oh, more Imaruzo, eh? <laughs> it is something else. Like, how can you wake up and, of all things, become sad just because someone else is happily living their life? How can you wake up and wish someone that all because of stanchi with all of this evil and and bad behavior stop when with this particular evil stop guys i was two days years old when i got to know that there's a measurement um used to determine who is genuinely happy and who is not genuinely happy who is faking it and who is not faking it. how can you say someone is desperate and just i'm um, trying to prove to be happy but she's not really happy how can you say that she's only faking her happiness when the videos she's posting, especially the ones I'm um, taking in London, you guys know she's in London, Licorice is in London right now. See, there can never be a too much as far as happiness is concerned. I mean, the world is tough enough, so why will happiness be too much for crying out loud? Why will it be too much? Can't they just allow those people to live their life and do what makes them happy? Is it too much to ask for? Is that difficult to do? Ah, guys, I know you're wondering what is happening. So, guys, hmm. as I said before, the Alicoro's trip to London has been causing so many drama left, right, centre from the very first day she went. Little did I know, guys, that um, it's going to get worse, like really worse soon. Like, this trip is seriously affecting some people psychologically, spiritually, emotionally, uh, physiologically, everything kali kali that you can think of, guys. Forget that I'm smiling at you guys. Know me, I try to make at least. Even it's very toxic, let me try to make it kind of less toxic to an extent. So this is actually a very serious case. So I know you're surprised, like I said before, now, and you're wondering what is happening this time around. Okay, guys. So let me take you through the journey of how it started so you don't get lost. They started first when someone who was apparently an Imaros Shippa posted and said, Why is the girls dropping the bar like this? Why is she making herself look so desperate to show people that she's indeed happy and having fun? Does everything need to be filmed? Hey, <laughs> cringe. They are making it look so fake. P.S. If she's really enjoying, then I'm happy for her. Hey, hey, I look at some people's posts sometimes, guys, and I can tell how they think and who they are. For example, this person, if I say what's in my mind, if I say what's in my mind, but let's move on. How does someone's happiness make you cringe for the love of God? Like, how is doing normal video of yourself now a crime? I mean, what is Instagram, Snapchat, Insta Story, and all of those things for? Are they not to share beautiful moments um, you choose to share with people? Normal, normal things that she has been doing before. So what makes this one desperate now? What makes her desperate with this one just because she traveled to London? Oh, wait. Is it that they were expecting her to be um, depressed? Like, did they actually want to see her unhappy, sad, hiding her face in shame and depressed? Is that what they actually wanted from her? Really? Oh, guys. <laughs> anyway, as if that was not enough, I mean, I was thinking I'm seeing it all only for another person who this time is an emirate, according to report, made a post, extremely terrible post, it was not this one that not even shocked me the most. Like, eh? Uh -huh. On top waiting, Father God. Guys, right now, they are wishing our enemy, not our in Jesus' name, not our in Jesus' name. They are wishing our enemy plane crash. How much can one 
take how much can one take you've done so many other terrible things now it is wishing that someone plane will crash that is what i were all for what exactly i mean this person was bored enough to go right over her post and quote with poor man's daughter you remain licking your fans ass ungrateful smelly bitch a wolf girl now on that bus you go remain <laughs> god wow 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 then i can't even read these things guys i'm sorry i didn't even know it's this bad i only saw the plane crash wow this is bad this is so 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 bad how can you reach someone plane crash how can a young lady enjoying her life and minding her business be giving you this much headache he was so full of this kind of negative it's like how um, on the heart of mine is truly desperately wicked and yes no one can know it except god though hmm. may god continue to guide and protect all of us so because this is extremely bad once again and yes just in case you don't know when you point one finger at someone the rest are directed at you meaning what you wish others is also what you will get in fact if not double as simple as that too so i'll not say more than that anyway moving on emmanuel was found um liking a hate post against Lee Chorus. Hmm. When I first saw this particular post on social media, I was like, hmm, no, how possible is that a man liking a true post against Lee Chorus? <laughs> and also seeing people saying, no, that is not his account. Stop framing him up. I too, I was like, yeah, that's true. People can do anything. Let me go and confirm the truth myself. So I went to his page, check his likes. Lo and build, it's right there two posts which were recently liked by him in fact at first i was sort of confused and i was asking is this really humanist page because, because most of us really had issues believing in well it is a page as you can see i even had to do a video to be really sure of what i was saying and also for clarity's sake so the first post says I love that the blogs that support her can't support her without chanting Emmanuel's name and to everyone who is advertising uh, blah 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 wow wow and the second post she has following me oh you know who you did follow sha i only sabi one person emmanuel omo just a little reminder this one did not even really really get to me is the um, the blogs that support her that really really kind of got to a lot of people hmm. as difficult as um this might be uh i want to believe this is for clout i really want to believe this is for clout seriously Seriously struggling to believe that um, Emmanuel we watched in the house is now liking posts like this against his friend or former friend as the case may be. I mean, come on, Tabanja Kunchebikaku now. That we are no longer friends doesn't mean we should now be wishing each other bad things. Seriously, now I'm seriously struggling not to believe Emmanuel has done out like that. I mean, he was just defending us some days ago, many days ago from one negative post about uh, just a few days ago. So what's happening now most people said forget he has always been like that jealous and all some saying he has changed and now he's tired of pretending so he's just showing his true colors others said um they noticed he has become so petty since the supposed separation <laughs> but now i still don't want to believe this just yet because this is not his character especially that is why i'm even doing this then if it is true then emmanuel this is bad and not the right way to go but then again let me still watch and not use this to judge guys what is your take please share in the comment section also pataka city are you ready are you ready to turn up for body lab fitness and fashion official opening it's finally done because we're gonna come out and have fun with your faves um guest celebrities such as wine money tega and princess oh i love this so much this is how tega loves Aima and, and how wine money loves is in day for me this is beautiful congratulations emmanuel the day is blessed on the last note sasuke breaking from the norm back to back she's really really been doing so well for herself baby is just busy doing her thing and minding her business especially the business that pays her so she's currently on a movie set alongside other big movie stars oh, this is amazing sasuke it's the fact that it's the fact that she's spreading um her wings and flying without limiting herself for me this is what i love the most about her from art to fashion to modeling painting now movie now this is commendable 